So this is what we won. 200 bucks. This is the unit right here. It's in Marlboro. A little bit of a drive. What's going on everybody? Hey, we got a storage unit. 2258. We paid about, uh, with, this, with the U-Haul, we paid about 350 for this unit. So let's check it out. Look at this goodness. Look at all this goodness. One of the things that caught my eye about this unit was the Beanie Babies. They were all covered in, I mean, yes, they're Beanie Babies, but they had covers on the things, which means they were kind of a collector. More boxes than I expected. I hopefully we can get it all in U-Haul. Another thing was uh, this box here. It's exact fragiles. I was hoping this was kind of like collectibles. Let's see. Uh, family pictures. We don't want to look at those. Family pictures. I can come in closer. Ah, Rondo. Watch on Rondo basketball shirt. That's cool. There's another Celtics shirt. Hayward. I don't know who the hell that is. He just got traded. It's clean. Uh, Jason Kidd, Dallas Mavericks. There you go. There's three basketball shirts right there. Coke tray. That's probably worth about a dollar. Yeah, there's a whole lot of. Uh, yeah, looks like there's a lot of collectibles of Syracuse, blankets. Let's check this out. This is from Marlboro Sports Team. Looks like a Steelers blanket. Yes, this is a Pittsburgh Steelers blanket. We can burn that because we don't like Pittsburgh Steelers. <laughs> so, yeah, looks like uh, we're going to have our work. So, that's it for now. guys happy good morning Sunday morning to everybody what's going on so I just saw I just ran the video of the storage unit we got the other day I uh, just want to show a few things that we got out of this unit let's start over here uh, Bret Hart tank top from 1989 pretty freaking cool find there um, I don't know if I can be able to do this in one hand uh, Bruce Bruins jersey I don't think this kid plays for the Bruins anymore. Nice jersey. We found some concert tees finally. 50 cent. I found a David Ortiz stitch jersey. Really nice. Uh, Motley Crue's last tour shirt. This doesn't look like it's even been worn. Looks like it was hanging in their closet with Alice Cooper. Really cool shirt. Scarface, vintage Scarface t-shirt. Uh, this is another vintage uh, Stone Cold Steve Austin t-shirt. Pretty cool. Uh, Leonard Skinner 2003 tour. Let's see in the back of it. We're on tour with... Yeah, that's awesome. Ted Nugent, Leonard Skinner. 2001, actually. This is considered vintage now. And what is this? Jammin' 94 Summer Jam. It's another one with uh, 50 Cent and a bunch of other guys that I have no idea who they are. 
there's a whole lot of randomness. There was these uh, vintage 90s uh, pictures. They're fake autographed by the wrestlers. Macho Man. Ultimate Warrior. Uh, David Ortiz commemorative patch from when he retired. This uh, Pineapple Pete pink bag. Uh, Louis Vuitton bag. This, I didn't think it was legit at first, and I ran the numbers and everything on the inside, and it is real. Pretty psyched about that. This coach, another one, real bag. I think we're missing the pouch for this. I don't know where that disappeared to. Scooby-Doo clock. Uh, brass. I think this is a lighter. Plain. Change. There was so much change in this unit. That whole thing's full of silver and pennies. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. This Jack Daniels thing is full of change. Found these old magazines, wrestling magazines. Uh, old colognes. These airsoft guns. Oh, there's one airsoft gun with the pellets and the, I think these are the, I don't know what these are, but I found this vintage cap gun in there. It's pretty cool. Yeah. Uh, let's go over here for a sec. All these hats. We, we got the million dollar beanie babies in here. The uh, princess dies. It's worth a million dollars, which really is not. But people are trying to sell them for a million dollars. A whole bunch of figures. Walkman. I said hats. Uh, cost jersey. More basketball jerseys. This is Hayward. Stitch Rondo. Celtics jersey. Pretty nice. Dallas Mavericks number five. That would be Jason Kidd. This is a I don't know. Oh, Nike golf shirt. New England Patriots sweater. Stitched. And New England Patriots t-shirt when they destroyed the uh, Falcons. And let's get down to the shoes. Nike shoes. They almost look new. More. They're in great condition. And there's more. I know nothing about sneakers, but I have somebody that does know something about sneakers, and he said these are worth a... Even dirty like this, they're worth a little bit of money. And those ones. So, I actually have... Um, so I actually have a whole bunch of other stuff that we put in storage that I just don't have the room for it in my office right now. So, I mean, there's a ton more stuff. So let me tell you the total right now. So, let me see here. Total storage unit. We paid $345 for this storage unit. As of right now, between... Um, the cash we found, the gift cards we found, the cash we found $11 in ones, uh, gift cards we found $80 and 55 cents. Uh, we sold a cart that was still in the box. It's over here too. We sold that on Amazon yesterday for $125. And then, uh, we sold a 14 karat gold class ring, Marlboro High class ring. We sold that last night for three hundred dollars. So let me see where do we stand? So we paid three forty five for the unit. We're already up five hundred and sixteen fifty five. So we're ahead three hundred and forty five dollars. No, is that right? No, we're ahead one hundred and seventy one dollars on the unit. 
Not bad for three days work. And I still have a shit ton to list. So that's gonna be it for now. I'll give you an update on this unit later on in the week. Uh, like, subscribe, share. Uh, please share. It's always good to share with other people. All right, peace out.